Danny Smith of America and Wayne Skipper in row two. Justin Maneff and Todd Wanless share row number three. Row number four, it's Bruce Hill and Brett Lansley. Row five, it's Brett Loadsman the inside and Jeffrey the outside. Row six, Kerry Madsen and Stacey. And row seven, Max Dumsney and the second of the Jeffreys. Get set for action. They come off turn number four down the front straight away. And Skip Jackson goes through to take over the lead as they head to the bottom corner. And look at Jackson fly through there as he works his way down the back straight. There's been a tangle at the back of the field as Max Dumsney goes out. And uh, one has uh, come back across the infield. So the red lights, or not the red lights, but the amber lights will come on. Three. Max, Max Dumsney has lasted one corner. He Three. and Lansley have connected. Three cars involved. Why not establish that and say, would you like to race? Pay us 50 a lap and save the black flag. All righty, John Shaw, Max Dumsney off the back of the field. Gary Brazy out of the race and Gary Rush Jr. on pole with Skip Jackson alongside. We're ready to go racing as they come off the fourth turn. Skip Jackson loses the jump initially as they go to the bottom corner. Keep an eye on Danny Smith as they make their way through the bottom turn and now work onto the back straight away. Rush Jr. leads it from Skip Jackson as they come around the top. Ben goes wide though and Jackson comes up on the inside of him as they make their way down to this bottom turn. Rush goes in very, very hard indeed. Comes out of the turn still leading from Jackson and Danny Smith. That's all Smith wants is a transfer spot. But Smith coming up putting plenty of pressure here on the inside of Skip Jackson. There they go down the front straight into the first turn. Danny Smith, the number seven car, working hard at the inside of Skip Jackson in 25. Max Dumsby had to yield ground towards the back of the field. He's making an almighty charge to try and come through, but he has a long way to go. A stoppage would certainly help him. Down the back straight away, it's Rush Jr. in the Castrol entry, followed through by Skip Jackson and the third car on your screen coming to the main straightaway is the American Danny Smith heading back to the pits as car 96. Well, Max Dumsey has passed a wall of cars as we follow Danny Smith down the back straight after the race leader, and that is uh, Skip Jackson, who sits in second. Gary Rush Jr. is the leader. Well, from the back of the field to position number nine is Max Dumsey. We're watching Gary Rush Jr. go down the back straight away in car number 51, goes to the inside of a lap car, gets the accelerator down and goes to turn number one. Now he heads towards the back straightaway, the tail hanging out. The difficulty for him now is he's going to come into a lot of lap traffic. Running in second spot is still Skip Jackson. He drives that 25 car to the main straightaway. Behind him is the American from Indiana. There's the leader, Gary Rush Jr. Well, he's clear, coming up on some lap cars as he goes down the back straight. Sets the car nicely about the middle of the racetrack coming through the bend but Jackson is catching him the man in second is gaining at probably about uh, three car lengths a lap Danny Smith of the United States runs in third there's Jackson here's Rush through the fourth turn working well, hard there's been a big bank up of cars in the back straight away and that's enabled Max Dumsney to catch a whole plethora of cars and he's now starting to work on a serious move through the field they're not going to catch the front running three they're through Gary Rush Jr. in the 51 car. Behind him is Danny Smith as Skip Jackson's car starts to lose power. It sits back in third. So Rush Jr. doing a good job in the second of the Castrol machines as he comes down the front straight. There's the gap back to uh, the man who's trailing him. The car behind him is Danny Smith in the seven car. And Skip Jackson is third in the 25. Wattles is fourth and... Uh, any number of cars still disputing fifth. There's the American running into the main straightaway. He's still in second place. And in the back straightaway, with just three laps to go, it's Gary Rush Jr., 26 years of age, back after a two and a half year layoff and looking a strong contender for tonight's A Main. Rush goes through, followed now by Danny Smith. Smith coming into it. As we go onto the back straightaway where Kerry Matson has parked up against the concrete wall. He's had difficulty with the uh, 29 car and is uh, on the wall on the back straight. And just watch Max, he'll hold back and go now. He's gone past it, now it's time to go and uh, pass some cars as he comes around the top corner. Rush Jr. leads into the bottom turn, here they come bicycling through that turn and throwing a plume of clay onto the back straightaway. Dumsley's already moved up one as they come down to the uh, top corner. Halfway down the front straight, Danny Smith of the United States. 
tries to muster a challenge, can't do it. There's Wanless going through in the number 24 car. He has actually gained some ground on Smith, and Dumsney is trying to get around the outside of Justin Manette, but losing ground. They come across the line, one lap to go. The checkered flag next time for Gary Rush Jr. Here he comes down the back straight now for the final time. Up into turn number three, car handling beautifully, checkered flag time as he comes out across the line, and he goes on to win. Gary Rush Jr. wins from Danny Smith, Todd Wanless of Queensland, and Wayne Skipper in the O'Brien aluminium car. He's taking one more lap just for old time's sake, but he's already won it. Second to Danny Smith, third to Todd Wanless, and they are the three transfer spots.